Good morning to all of you. Uh, through this video, we are just going to share the contents of the Sheffield Law of Tolerance, which included in Unit 2 of the CC5. So, according to this law, organism success is based on the complete set of conditions and that each organism has a certain minimum, maximum and optimal environmental factor or combination of factor that determines the success. So, according to the Sheffield Law of Tolerance, there is an upper limit and lower threshold value on gradient beyond which these species cannot survive. So, there are three zones of the uh, bell-shaped curve. First one is the optimal zone, second one is zone of stress and the third one is the zone of intolerance. So, uh, this response of an organism to a range or gradient of an, or, uh, of an environmental factor. So, this figure depicts that the range of the optimal zone, the zone of the stress and the, the, uh, and the place where the no organism survives is the zone of intolerance. So here are the prefixes which uh, is added to the word that is stenohydric, urohydric, stenohaline, urohaline and steno means narrow and the ure means wide range of the toler intolerance or tolerance. So here is a graph of the ure uh, topic and the stenotopic. So this is all about the uh, Stephal law of tolerance. So keep watching. Thank you.